Ooh, okay. Nuketown 24-7. What is going on, everybody? Stabs here. Welcome back to another one of my videos. Now, um, I don't know if you guys remember or not, if my last video, if you guys watched it or not, um, I actually talked about how basically a lot of stuff were going wrong um, for my actual computer and all my stuff that I needed to actually record videos and edit them and stuff like that. Um, for now, you guys know that in the video, I actually talked about... Um, Sony Vegas and my capture card, which is the Hapog. Now, ooh, let me just try and see if we can get some of these kids right here. All right. Um, ooh, oh, how did I not just get that kill? All right, but anyway, um, basically, I did get Sony Vegas back. It took like two, three days to figure it out, so that's why I didn't really upload um, <clears throat> for that time span. I really hope this kid doesn't push me over here. Oh, oh you clueless, clueless, buddy. But, um, like I said, you know, it did take me like two, three days to actually get Sony Vegas back. So that's kind of why I didn't really upload for like, um, a solid, I think it was actually two days exact. Um, but, uh, I did let you guys know on Twitter on what was going on and stuff like that. So, um, that was that. I did get Sony Vegas back so I could actually, um, upload my videos and render them too without using Movie Maker. That last video that I upload, um, actually ex explaining it, I did use... Uh, movie maker, which is completely awful. I am not winning that with a pistol, and I'm about to get pushed from the back. And that kid is booty. All right, the shotgun in the hill. But um, the other thing I did talk about was um my capture card. Now, if you guys don't know, I actually do use the uh, Hapog or HD PVR2, and I've had this thing for quite a while. Ever since I did start YouTube, um, this is the first thing I got. Why? Because I didn't really know. Um, too much about you know what was good about the stuff and uh, like what can make it better and quality and stuff like that I just got the one thing that I knew I was gonna need which was a capture card and um, I just got I think it was the cheapest one at the time I don't actually think it was the cheapest one I think it was the same price as the Elgato um, the first one and I, that one I remember I think it says something for like max or something that it's port um compatible with that and I didn't think I needed that so I just didn't want to spend like the extra 10 bucks 10 15 dollars um, on the Elgato so I just stuck with the HD PVR now the thing with the HD PVR um, it doesn't really have an a uh, editing software which I don't really need because I do have Sony Vegas now so that's not really an issue um, the thing with it is though um, if you guys for you technical people out there if you stream or record your own videos um, I do use OBS with my gameplays and stuff like that so that basically lets me have my my, web my, ooh, my webcam um, it lets me sync my what uh, my mic up to my gameplay and my little overlay you guys can see all my social media and stuff like that that's all done with OBS now um, another thing with the Hapog which I really 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 do not like um, is the delay for gameplay now if you guys don't know this um, every single capture card that you have to plug into like a computer that's not in uh, internal that you do not have to plug into computer. I think I said that you have to. Um, anything that is like through HDMI, through like a little box, like the uh, the first Elgato or stuff like that, uh, you do. It has a two to four second delay, and depending on whatever one you have, like I don't think any of them are actually the same. So um, you could have one that's like mine is like 2.5 seconds. It took me a while to actually get that delay perfectly right. So. Um, and a problem with that, oh, hang on one second. Oh, God. All right. Um, a problem with that is that you actually need to sync up your gameplay with your mic and your webcam. So, like, if you guys haven't noticed, um, whenever I do, used to do a lot of gameplays, especially, oh, God, it's got it's flying in the air. Um, for those gameplays I used to do with the GB matches and TLs and stuff like that, back in AW mostly, um, you guys could notice that. Um, if I was in a Skype call, which I usually did talk through, um, you guys could always hear those callouts first before you hear mine, which always turned out pretty bad uh, because it looked like, like honestly, the way I used to think about it, like I feel like you guys thought I was like completely retarded or stupid. I, I probably shouldn't say retarded, but uh, just like completely lost within the game that I would like have that much of a slow reaction time, and um, 
turn that slow or whatever to a call out but usually when i hear it and when i turn that is actually when i do hear it so um there's not much i could do about that it's literally and nothing possible that i could do about it uh just because it's the actual hapog itself and uh to record it through obs i need to screen capture it and um have it through obs like that and the problem with that is it's like a screen capture or something like that so the thing is i'm not even using the hapog um how i should be wow i just saved all of us um, I'm not really say uh, ooh, I'm not really using it how I should be, uh, just because um, the usual one records in like 1080p I think and like 60 frames per second, which I don't really believe, but um, that's what it says. And um, the problem with that is that when you screen, where the hell did this kid? Woo, this kid's lagging everywhere. The problem with um, using Hapog and OBS, uh, you can't actually connect the Hapog to the um obs software which um i obviously need so um if i do want to use it how i'm using it now i you i have to have that delay or i just can't use my webcam my overlay and stuff like that so um one thing that i've actually been thinking of doing is uh like i talked about in my last video i've been thinking of getting a new capture card now this is going to be good because a this thing my HTPVR right now is currently very very old um, like I said, I've had it, I think, since, um, ooh, what, what is this lag, this game, dude? What is going on? But, um, I've had it ever since I started YouTube, I guess, and that hasn't, what is that? I don't even know, it's been a couple years, and my screen is doing that jittery lag, I don't know what's going on, but that was weird. Alright, so, I've been thinking of getting a new capture card, which will obviously be good, because the one that I'm thinking of getting will be the Avermedia C985. And uh, what that can do is basically it's meant for streaming, so I do not have to um, screen capture it through OBS. I could just actually plug it in, and it's compatible with that, and it'll work perfectly fine. So with that, that means that it'll be. I think um, you can run it in 1080p, 30 frames per second, which um, is good. Obviously, it's clear, but for first-person shooters, fast-paced games like that, you want higher frames. And what you can actually do is um have 720p at 60 frames which i think i'll actually do and uh if you guys don't know uh scumpy actually had that uh a while ago i, th I don't know what he's using now i actually asked him on twitter and a bunch of you guys actually on twitter to see if anybody or him would even respond which would be awesome but um i don't know which ones he's using so um i'm thinking again that because i know for a fact he's used that um in the past i don't know if he's using it currently that's my problem so, oh, let me just use that real quick, and they all disappeared. All right. So, uh, what was I saying? Um, I'm thinking of getting the Avermedia C985 because um, I can plug it in. It'll be, I think it, it's close to zero delay, which is really good. So, say if I do play like a 2v2 match or something with Monday kills and for life, um, you guys are actually going to hear it in real time of how I'm hearing it. And um, another thing is that... Um, you got I won't have to have my mic what is this kid doing I won't have to have my mic and webcam delayed for me to actually talk in this so it'll be 100% paired up with my gameplay and I don't know where these kids just went so that'll be really really good obviously it'll be better and uh, like I said it is a lot better quality because I don't know if you guys have noticed this um, the HTTP VR quality is trash and I'm like I feel so, I go back and watch it sometimes and like you can't read some of the letters that I'm talking about some of the games some of gamer tags and stuff like that so uh, I want to get something to hopefully grow my channel and stuff like that with a better quality obviously you could do that so I've been thinking of doing that uh, let me know what you guys actually think about that because I mean it is a hundred and fifty dollars right now I don't know it's usually like 150 to 170 but um, is that a body no it is not all right so, I mean, I can buy it, I guess, but um, what I'm thinking of doing, actually, you know, sticking with this HTPVR for a little bit while, a uh, while longer, and um, just use it until I do get a job, which I'm planning on doing, because if you guys didn't know, uh, I was actually waiting to get a job after I get my license, and I actually got my license on Wednesday, which is, what is this, what do you got, all these guys are lagging, it's like a Chinese server. Um, I actually got my license on Wednesday still haven't driven anywhere for some reason. I don't know why um, My parents just haven't given me the car um, But I do need to buy my own car which kind of sucks that and um, Like I said, I do want to get a job first before I start blowing my money like that um, So I do have a little bit spending and stuff like that just in case if I do need it 
Um, so let me you guys think about that because if it is getting really bad or if my hog kept acting up like how it did those couple days ago, um, I will get the Avermedia and just the thing I'm like worried about is if the quality would be a lot better because like I said, it'll be about the same price as this um, when I got it. So it is pretty old, the Avermedia itself. I think it's like four years old, but it's still a lot better and it's meant for streaming. So the quality and uh, latency is really, really good. So just let me know what you guys think about that. And um, hopefully after that, I just won't have a lot more problems with um, my setup, I guess. I don't know, really not explain it like that. And um, I won't really have enough issues and I'll have better quality, which is really the only thing I'm looking for because I do want to start taking this thing a lot more serious i have since like the last day of school and and uh my progress with views and subscribers can show that like my views is up 100 percent, which is absolutely like sick and um you know to get that double of what i'm getting now and uh you know by the time school starts which is going to be like beginning of september um i want to be at 4,500 subscribers at least around there because that's going to be really good for a channel my size that's good time for um the, the size i am now so um the game here is actually coming to an end depending if my team will end it and we got a kid in the other corner over here Ooh, almost pre-fired the hell out of that kid but uh yeah so i'm gonna try and either save up first and uh get the job and see what happens or you know whatever just happens happens i'll let you guys know but um oh god right behind these kids 60 I just 62 kills with the pistol 60 I didn't get any streaks what's up with oh my I just completely abolished these kids bro literally didn't even realize like I just kept talking the whole time and I didn't realize how many kills I was having but hope you guys enjoyed if you did remember to comment subscribe follow social media links down in the description below hit the like button at least for 60 plus kills with pistols without even realizing let's try and get to 25 likes and I'll see you guys next time. Peace out. If you guys have any questions, let me in the comment section below. And I'll see you guys next time.